Hello, welcome to a new episode of Journey to the Chateau. We're happy Valentine's Day. Uh, we went to a um, actually very special Valentine's Day location at St. Valentine's, that, which is close. And we have started a new, yet another new project. Bonsoir à tous. Joyeux Saint Valentin. Bienvenue à Journey to the Chateau de Colombe. Und nun zu unseren Freunden aus dem deutschsprachigen Raum, herzlichen äh, St. Valentinstag ähm, für alle Liebenden. Äh, wir haben einen Ort hier ganz in der Nähe und die feiern St. Valentinstag, denn der Ort heißt St. Valentin. Und wir haben ein, jetzt noch ein neues Projekt angefangen. <lacht> okay, yes. And so, you know, because we don't have enough projects going on, yes. we decided we were going to start a new one this past week, right? Right, so it's it, 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 it is. It is. Right. So uh, we we figured we're working on one water closet. We might as well work on two. Yeah, I mean, just you know, going for, uh, <laughs> basically cutting out half of you know, the toilets in your chateau. It's always a good idea <laughs> at right. the same time. Right. So we do have a, we do have a water closet that is uh, in the entrance hall. Yes. Under the main uh, grand staircase, and this will be the primary. Uh, bathroom, water closet, toilet, that people will use, uh, visitors, people coming to dinner, you know, so, yep. you know, we thought that was important to actually renovate this as well. Yes. So, but sooner than later. It's just saying having people, you know, at bed and breakfast, and they're in the, in the breakfast room and someone said, I need to use the facilities because I need to pee. And it's right there. So right. instead of going all the way back up to their room and using the, you know, here's a facility yes. they can actually use. So we started, we have now started the renovation on that, which we'll have later in this episode. Uh, but because this is Valentine's Day, yes, we made a trip uh, recently, yes. Meeting today, actually. Yes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to where did we go? San Valenta. We did.
Hello, so, <laughs> nice new project yet again. So I just removed two hand handles from um, the little bathroom under the stairs because we're working on that as well as the other water closet. Um, the entryway, the back, a single bedroom and the sheet. So those are our projects that are all going on at the same time. Now, let me show you what we're doing here. So this is the, well, a bit underwhelming. Uh, this looks horrible, doesn't it? <laughs> here, when, it, when it's all cleaned up and then a week later, it looks like this. So anyways, it's very, this is under the stairs. Let me show you actually where that is located. So this is the front door, you come in and there under the stairs, it's not a cupboard, it is a toilet. So this toilet will have a vanity here under the window. It's a cute little window. Uh, there is a storage space. It's huge, actually, comparatively speaking. Uh, and the toilet will be roof. We have everything here. Uh, of course, the floor will be redone and the walls will be fixed and painted. And the pipes will disappear because we're going to, uh, Stuart will build a box that goes around them so they are no longer visible. But this is not very tall here. So we decided we are going to take down this ceiling. Not really looking forward to it, but it's, um, there is quite a bit of space still there. So it might be very rustic when we're done, but better than... I can't stand this, Stuart can't stand up straight here. So uh, let's just say it's, uh, at least for the two of us and maybe a couple of other people, it will be better. And I'm gonna start that now. So I'm attempting to do this with as little mess and dust as possible, if that's possible. Okay. Okay, wish me luck. No idea what's gonna happen.
So, sealing is down. Fantastic. I'm just waiting for the um, dust to settle, and then you can pick it all up. Okay. <laughs> Now, one thing we can say, we're really glad we did this because, yes, our, our staircase is walnut wood. It's lovely. Mm -hmm. Who knew that they also used walnut beams? And they look really fantastic. I have to sand them and treat them and nurture them because they have been covered up for a long time and they're here for almost 400 years. So it, that's um, a job I'm looking forward to. <laughs> right. So, yes. Uh, and, you know, we're trying as, as best as we, as we can to make this a chateau for a bit taller people than it used to be. <laughs> yes. And this is no, no dig on people who are not as tall as we are. Right. No one can determine their height. So we and are. By the way, we, should, we, should go ahead, we should go ahead and say, because we've had people who have in comments who have speculated on this. So I am actually six foot even in height. Yes. Yes, and you are? I'm six foot four and a half. So that means right. I'm one meter 95 and Stuart is one meter 80. So there. Right. So we are really glad that we're able to raise the ceiling on this water closet. Right. Yes. And other people will be too. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll have more of that in uh, upcoming episodes. Yes, and well, the, the, mm -hmm. the, the, the doors, there's the door to the water closet and from the water closet to the storage under the stairs. Mm -hmm. They need to be completely redone. I Absolutely. Mean, there's, there's quite a bit of work and it's a lot of detail work, which unfortunately takes a lot of time. Right, right. So I love it. <laughs> so we also, uh, quite recently, uh, made another trip to our search for headboards. Oh, good grief. So we are searching for multiple headboards. We're searching for uh, a lovely headboard that we can use in the bed and breakfast room. Yes. As well as headboards now for the new room in the Jeet. And for the, for the new, yes, for the, for, for the Jeet that we're reconfiguring mm -hmm. and the Jeet that we're building out, we don't have a headboard. So it's... Right. Let's just say it's it's difficult and short of um, driving to Normandy and steal one from Terry Nash, which we're not. <laughs> we might. No. No, we won't. We're not, no, not stealing. No, we're not. <laughs> no, no. So no, we don't do that. We we still haven't <laughs> found anything that we like and that is that would be appropriate for for the period. Right. So right. So we made a trip to uh, one of our uh, more favorite MIUs to see if they might have something. Yes.
Very successful trip. Right. Just so, not quite important. Right. <laughs> we didn't find what we were looking for, but we did find things. Yes. Right. So, this is a beautiful. Stuart's going to show this again more detail, but it's gold and has this Provence blue. Uh, and it's, it's made in France. So, this is going to be the milk jug for our bed and breakfast guests. Lovely, really pretty. Yeah. And then we got this um, coffee pot, and it's not a chocolate pot because a chocolate pot always has something to stir it. This is a coffee pot from uh, 1892. Uh, and a, a whole bunch of linens. Right. We actually, <laughs> we got, uh, there is, in this in this specific MIUS that we went to, Yes. there is a separate room. Now this is a, this may seem a little odd, very. <laughs> <laughs> but they have a separate room at this MIUs that's called the retro room. And it's only open certain times. One day a month. Right, basically. It is, it is one day a month. They open up just one room of this MIUs. Yes. Right. And so, and they have, they have a lot of things in this fantastic room. A lot of things, uh, they have a lot of clothes. They have a lot of uh, things that would be uh, costume sort Can of things. Can just say, and a lot of clothes for women. They're ball oh, gowns, yes, yes. regular gowns. And very costume. I mean, there are, there are a lot of period pe of costumes. There's like very uh, things that I told Patrick is like something Shakespearean. Yes. Or, so it, really a, a fantastic room with all these different things in it. Wedding dresses. Right. And of course, they had it decorated for Valentine's Day, so they had like red everywhere in this No wonder they only opened it once right. a month because they're so busy decorating for that one day. <laughs> so the other thing that they have in this room that uh, that we liked was they have a lot of fabrics and notions for, for doing things like you know, laces and uh, all different things for sewing and things yes. like that, right? And so we did find some things. Yes. A little bit is here. Those are mm -hmm. napkins. I think these are what, 24 napkins or something? Yes. Uh, so they have things, that they're, they're pretty good about doing things like that where they actually tie them together in bundles. Yes. And they wrap a ribbon around them. So if you want like similar types of things, but it's very rare that you find things where they have like such a large bundle of things like napkins. Yes, sets of 12. Right, right. And that's what we're looking for. So we actually did find a couple of them yes. while we were there. Now, another thing we found is a lot of lace. So what we are planning to do, because we want to participate in the next uh, Jour de Patrimoine, so that's the history weekend here, uh, and we would like to do that in costume. It is incredibly hard to find any damasks. Mm -hmm. Hey, Ginger. Ginger is commenting on this. She finds she it really annoying too. She's sitting right there. <laughs> Uh, so we can't find any good damasks or silks or anything that we can turn into coats or vest coats or vests, as right. they say in other country, right. countries. So we, we are trying to find thing, uh, uh, fabrics that we can use for costumes so far. Mm -hmm. and, right. <laughs> it hasn't happened yet. But we're still looking. We are. We are. Uh, so, uh, that's it for this episode. Oh, good lord, we're at the end. We are. So, uh, if you like, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, like and recommend us to your friends and family and subscribing does not cost you anything, but it helps us tremendously. And please don't hesitate to comment. We, uh, said that last week, said, please comment. And there were people who said, okay, you asked for a comment and they did. It was absolutely wonderful. That was wonderful. great. Yes. So thank you so much for your comments. Yes. And if you want to support the renovation of the chateau, you can join us on Patreon. Or buy us a coffee. And we will see you on Friday. Absolutely. Au revoir. Au revoir. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> happy Valentine's Day. Oh, happy Valentine's happy Day. Day. Cheers. Cheers. If you enjoyed this video, please use the like feature to let us know. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our Journey to the Chateau YouTube channel if you would like to see more. Once you've subscribed, you can tap the notification bell in order to ring it, which will allow you to receive all notifications from our channel. Thank you.
Thank you.